Is it normal to feel back pain during pregnancy? Back pain during pregnancy is one of the most common symptoms. About 3 out of 4 women experience some type of back pain during pregnancy. During pregnancy, the body undergoes major changes in preparation for birth, and these changes can put a lot of stress on the lower back muscles and joints. Fortunately, most of the back pain during pregnancy is temporary, and it can be easily treated. Although it might feel as though your body is breaking down, you are actually just stretching out as your baby grows. You may experience pain in your lower back, lumbago, your middle back, pregnancy back pain, or your upper back, migraines. The key to feeling better is knowing what is normal and what isn't and taking steps to manage your symptoms. How early does back pain during pregnancy start? Back pain during pregnancy is common. There are some women who experience it as early as the 3rd to 15th week. However, pain during pregnancy is more commonly experienced between the 5th and 7th months. Because of the changes in your body, it is not surprising that you would experience back pain. You are carrying a child and these changes can cause strain on your back. This is why you should consult your obstetrician. He or she can give you tips on how to deal with the pain. How to relieve back pain during pregnancy. You probably won't be able to prevent back pain, but you can do certain things that will minimize it. Follow these tips to relieve back pain during pregnancy. Number 1. Practice good posture. Number 2. Get the right gear. Number 3. Lift properly. Number 4. Sleep on your side. Number 5. Try heat, cold, or massage. Number 6. Include physical activity in your daily routine. Number 7. Consider complementary therapies. What are the causes of back pain during pregnancy? Number 1. Weight gain. Through a healthy pregnancy, some women gain weight very quickly. When that happens, it puts stress and pressure on the spine which causes back pain. In some cases, the added strain may affect the woman's nerves and blood cells in her pelvis or lower back. Number 2. Hormone changes. During pregnancy, women experience something called the relaxin effect. Relaxin is a hormone that makes joints more flexible and softer during childbirth. On the other hand, it can also make the joints supporting women's spines and pelvic area systemically unstable due to this crucial hormone. The same hormone will cause ligaments to loosen up, making them unstable and very vulnerable in such a delicate time. Number 3. Posture changes. Pregnancy can stress your abdomen and your back muscles, gradually shifting your center of gravity and changing how you walk, too. That may result in pain or strains. Number 4. Muscle separation. After the uterus has expanded, the muscles lining the abdomen may begin to separate along the center seam. This separation causes back pain for some women during the second half of pregnancy. Number 5. Stress. As you approach your due date, the emotional and physical stress that goes along with it may cause muscle tension in your back. You may find that you experience increased muscle strain or spasms in areas of your back close to the pelvic area. Is a heating pad good for back pain during pregnancy? There are lots of reasons to use a heating pad during pregnancy. Some women use a heating pad to relieve leg cramps, lower back pain, or even to take away the aches from a long day of working at a desk. However, pregnancy heating pads can be dangerous, especially if you don't know the proper way to use one. According to the Cincinnati Children's Hospital Medical Center, a heating pad should never be placed directly on the abdomen. The best way to use a heating pad for back pain during pregnancy is to place it on the lower back and then cover it with a thin blanket. This way, the heat from the pad can be felt all over the back, but won't burn your skin. When to go to the hospital for back pain during pregnancy. When to go to the hospital for back pain during pregnancy A woman's body changes during pregnancy as the growing baby puts pressure on the mother's body. You may feel discomfort, back pain or chills, or you may find you get tired more easily. It's normal to have these symptoms, but the pain should not be severe or persistent. Back pain during pregnancy is common but some women have severe pain that lasts a long time. If you have pain that doesn't go away or gets worse, you should see your doctor.